Um, it's definitely been a long season, but at the same time, I feel like it's gone by really quickly, um, and that happens every year. And so there's definitely a lot of matches that go through my head as we're going into postseason and different phases. And so we've definitely had some really high moments, and we've had some days where we probably wish we, you know, performed a little bit better as well. Um, and so we did have a stretch at the beginning of conference, uh, beginning of the season, where we weren't playing the way we knew we could. Um, and I think we've just all kind of locked in and worked harder and gone every day. We know every single match is a challenge in the season. You know, there are no gimmies, there's no easy opponent. And so we have to work every single day. And I just think that we've been doing that a little bit better lately, but we've still been playing some really great teams and they've been some tough wins. You know, this is our first time going in three years. Um, and so definitely the objective every single season, I'm sure for everyone in this conference, is to make the playoffs and be one of those last eight teams standing and then have the opportunity to fight for that championship. Um, so our mindset was no different this year. You know, we wanted it just as badly the past two years. And so being able to work hard in the off season and in season and everything like that, I think it definitely is awesome to finally make it to the postseason and, you know, get where we wanted to be from day one. Um, so I'm excited to be in it um, and to bring this group. I think this is a particularly special team. Uh, and so I think I'm really excited for seeing what we're going to do in this postseason. But, you know, definitely really pumped to be back and have the opportunity to fight for a championship. We have such great leadership this year. Um, and so that starts with our captains, but more so we have five seniors that I think have been doing a really good job all season for us and leading in a variety of different ways, whether it be on the court or off the court or by example and or more vocally. And so I think that's been something that's really carried us through this season. And I'm sure they will be key contributors in this postseason as well. We're really excited going into this game on Tuesday. Obviously, we got to win against them over the weekend. Um, we know that means that they'll be coming out um, with even more intensity and out for blood, but we're super excited for the matchup, and I think it's going to be a really good one. Coming in freshman year, it was awesome making the playoffs, and um, not making it the past two years was definitely hard, and I think uh, that gave us even more drive and motivation to do it this year. Um, we're super excited going into conference play, and um, it should be a good one. The season was definitely up and down. Uh, we opened up with a Skyhawk Invitational, and that went pretty well for us. And you know, we had Indiana, and that was a big learning experience for us. And um, from there, we've just every day taken ourselves into the gym and learned how to be better for ourselves and how to play with each other and really just grown from there. Um, so it's going to be big for us to just continue to be seamless and continue for us to play as one and make sure we're all working together and just continuing that mindset is what's got us here. So just working on that. I think going to Adelphi will be very interesting. I know we have a lot of adrenaline. We're all very excited for this matchup. Um, we obviously did very well against them on Friday. And so we're excited to go see them in their gym. And luckily for us, we have a lot of Long Island natives. So we know we have a lot of support coming down with us. And we know that there's going to be a lot of familiar faces in the crowd. And that just because it's not our home gym, uh, we're prepared to take it as our own. Definitely great um, to be back in playoffs, uh, you know, and bring this team. Um, our seniors went when they were freshmen, so um, that's always really exciting. And every single team in this conference, I'm sure their objective is the beginning of the season. They want to be one of the last eight teams standing and fighting for a championship. And so that's definitely been our goal in all three seasons. And unfortunately, the past two years, we weren't you know one of the eight and we were just on the outside looking in and so I know we've had added incentive um, this year and and really pushed for that goal um, and we're fortunate to be one of the eight teams fighting for a championship this conference is so competitive um, so you know I think it was there's between third and 11th there's only a two game or two win separation um, and that just tells you how competitive our conference is and so we know every single day when we go out there we have to put our best out there and that there's no easy wins and um, on our schedule. And so that's just kind of been our mindset is attack every game and go hard at every single team because they all matter. And we're fortunate enough to have won enough of them this year to still have that opportunity to fight for a championship. So I know we feel fortunate about that, but we're also ready and hungry to keep this season going uh, from here and this week and beyond. Everyone has stepped up, underclassmen and upperclassmen, both in leadership and just doing their job on the court. Um, I think mindsets were definitely turned around in the middle of the season where we knew we had to do our job to get what we wanted. We can't just keep saying it. Um, so that's definitely a big part of it, how we turned our season around. 
um, and we just have to keep doing that going into the playoffs. Going into this postseason is super exciting. Uh, obviously our senior class went our freshman year and it was so much fun and the, one of the best parts our freshman year going was having our senior class at that time being so excited and making it a bigger experience and so I think that's really what we want to embody for our underclassmen this year is make it exciting and make them know what it feels like so that they continue to have that hunger for the next four years and that they continue to want this experience. It's a unique situation where we just played uh, Adelphi on Friday and now we get to play them again on Tuesday. Um, and so we know that it was a really competitive and hard fought match on Friday. Uh, we were fortunate enough to get the win in three. Um, and so that should give us you know, a little boost of confidence. But at the same time, we knew on Friday they were a really great team and that it was going to take our best effort. And I think we stepped up in a lot of different ways for that. Um, so we know that that's what's going to be required again of us. I think we executed our game plan pretty well on Friday. And obviously we know now both sides are going to adjust and kind of counteract each other. Um, and so they have a great team down in Delphi. They have a great coaching staff. So I'm expecting them to come out strong against us and have a good plan of attack. And that's just what we're doing on our end too, is, you know, kind of reshuffling the scout and, and figuring out what we need to go with. And then more just preparing to go as hard as you can, um, especially with all these teams being so close to each other and, uh, you know, win or go home. Uh, a lot of hard work and passion can determine or sway a match. So we need to be disciplined enough to stay in our system, but we need to also be ready to give everything we have to every single point um, because every single point's going to matter. I think it's going to be a battle uh, and a really close match. So it should be exciting.